Hello, this is Jim McKeith. I'm going to show you really quick how to uh, connect to a local instance, your default username and password, and adding and creating local databases with Interbase 2017. Uh, first thing you need to do is you need to launch the Interbase Manager and make sure you have Interbase currently started. Now you may have multiple uh, instances on your system. If you do, uh, you can have multiple Interbase Managers tells you the instance right here. So I'm going to go ahead and hit start. Um, however you want to start it is fine, whether it's as a service or automatic. So now it's running. So I'll go ahead and name the IB console. You most likely already have this set up. It gets set up for you automatically. But I'm going to walk through the steps just so you can see, um, see the steps and see what's going on there. So we're going to add a server. And we're going to specify a uh, local instance here. The default password is master key, M-A-S-T-E-R-K-E-Y. And I'm going to say save, hit next, and I'm not going to specify an instance. So there you go. Here's our local server, uh, GDSDB. Now I can add a database to this. I can create a database or add a database. So let's start with creating a database. And we will call it uh, test most likely going to leave these as defaults. Um, you could, there may be instances you want to change that. Consult the documentation for more information on those. Um, I've generally always left this as defaults. And I'm going to save password, which is great for development, but not good for production. Since, you know, passwords are important. Okay, so I've got a local database. From here, I could run SQL scripts to create tables, so on and so forth. I'll also show you how to connect to an existing database. I'm going to come here and say, um, oops, wrong point, come here, and say add database, and I can now browse to a database file and connect to that one. So there we go, we've connected to two databases. Uh, let's go ahead and connect to it from our application here. So I'm gonna use FireDAC, uh, FD connection, Driver ID is interbase. Database, this is the database file I want, which uh, it's on my desktop. And we'll do the test database. And the username is sysdba, password is master key. I always hit test. Connection established successfully. And we're done. Um, one thing I love about Fire deck is I can actually come over here and I can run SQL commands and test the data and see what's going on, create tables, stuff like that as well if I wanted to. Uh, in this case, I don't have any data in there to test. But there you go, that's the basics of connecting to a local uh, database instance, creating local databases, and adding existing databases.